Now we're going to get down and dirty. Some of the toughest of jobs are right here in the city, and we have some of the most dedicated employees. So we sent our Matthew Worth down under, deep down below Bolton Street. It's the return of dirty city jobs. Matthew Worth here with Dirty City Jobs. We're over here at the Bolton Street Stormwater Brick Line. It's an old, historic, 150-year-old, handmade brick line for stormwater. From what we know that was built back around the Civil War era with three layers of brick, and that was what they generally had was a wooden form. And they had that form, and they would drag it along. They'd put the layers of brick over it. How they did that by hand with, uh, without the technology we have today, from everything from dewatering to bracing the shores, and the conditions they worked with, must, it's just incredible that they got that done. And that kind of craftsmanship is lost. There's, there's not any folks that could do this anymore. We're about to climb down inside and check it out. About an eight and a half foot in diameter. We can walk in it easily all the way from, starts from about here and continues all the way up uh, to East Broad there. And it drains an area that's to the other side of Forsyth and to the north and west a good bit. And that's terracotta pipe. And they were using that up to the 70s. That's a clay pipe, and that was a sewer line. Some amazing uh, craftsmanship to, to build a line like that. The three layers of the old Savannah Gray brick, uh, and it's lasted 150 years. Uh, it's, it's really done its job. Uh, this line will clean itself when it has a good rain. What we saw also was the places that are damaged, uh, the, where the brick is washed away, where. Uh, because at one time it was both uh, stormwater and sanitary sewer line. Yeah, that was from the top, dig down to it, and they're lucky the rest of them didn't collapse when they did it. One of the things we're going to have to do, of course, is go in and, and patch those holes, and then this technology that we've got to push through uh, material that will then harden. We heat it up and it hardens and essentially lines that with something that should give us another 100 years of service out of this line. What they'll do is they'll go in first and remove all the pipes and extrusions in it, get in a nice smooth wall, and then they take this giant, it's a resin impregnated sock, it's pretty much a, a felt material that uh, they'll put over the hole, and then they'll they'll invert this sock with uh, water, and use that pressure of, of the water to get the sock all the way down the line. Once it's full, they heat that sock, and that cures the resin. It'll be like a fiberglass pipe. That pipe there, will be, that'll last us probably outlast our lifetime and hopefully our kids. Coming up from down under Bolton Street, this is Matthew Worth with Dirty City Jobs. Thank you very much, Matthew. Yes, it's a Dirty City Job, but you do get all the fun, don't you?